Hey guys, I'm so excited to be here with you guys today. I'm going to read you a little book um, since I can't be with you guys. Um, we're going to read Strictly No Elephants. The trouble with having a tiny elephant for a pet is that you never quite fit in. No one else has an elephant. Every day I take my elephant for a walk. His is a very thoughtful sort of walk. He doesn't like the cracks in the sidewalk much. I always go back and help him over. That's what friends do. Lift each other up over the cracks. Today I'm walking my tiny elephant to number 17. It's pet club day and everyone will be there. Come along, there's a good boy. I coax him the last few feet. It'll be fine. When I look up, there's a sign on the door. Strictly no elephants. My tiny elephant leads me back to the sidewalk, never minding the cracks. That's what friends do. Brave the scary things for you. Oh, they're so sad. Walking in the rain. Did you try to go to the pet club meeting too? The girl asks. Yes, I say, but they don't allow elephants. The sign didn't mention skunks, the girl says, but they don't want us to play with them either. They don't know any better, I tell her. He doesn't stink, the girl adds. No, he doesn't, I agree. What if we start our own club? Come along, I say, making certain that my tiny elephant follows me because that's what friends do. Never leave anyone behind. And there's everyone with all their different pets. So we paint our own sign. All are welcome. My tiny elephant will give you directions if you need them. Because that's what friends do. The end. I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day and I hope to talk to you guys soon.